Welcome to Sunview Patio Doors. My name is Tony Marjada, President. Look around, you're in Sunview's Woodbridge facility in Canada. We're gonna take you on a 360 degree tour of our manufacturing facility to give you a first hand view into the advanced material handling technology we've implemented to help us improve safety and flexibility to our processes. You're about to experience what it's like to have an auto autonomous mobile robot or AMR play a role on our team and manufacturing process. I'm Kurt Oberparleiter, the VP of Operations. As auto drives, it uses LiDAR sensors and stereo cameras to map its surroundings, detect how far away objects are, and replan paths so it can safely navigate around obstacles autonomously. As you can see, Maunik and Harris are blocking Otto's path. Let's watch how Otto navigates around them. Even if Maunik jumped right in front of Otto, I have no concerns about a collision because Otto is smart enough to react, just like a human would in the same situation. Millions of laser beams are projected 160 feet in front of Otto, which form a detailed image of the environment in which it is driving. This is one of the ways Otto ensures it will continue to reach its destination in the most efficient manner without the need for magnetic strips or other infrastructure to guide it. When evaluating material handling technologies, we set out to find something that was safer than a forklift and smarter than an AGV. It became very evident that Otto would fulfill a niche that no other material handling technology could. If you look to the pickup and delivery stand, you'll notice that the finished goods have already been packaged and placed on top. This was done by the team members in this work cell who are now freed up to do other things. As Otto arrives to the P&D stand, it picks up the load unassisted and prepares to deliver to the warehouse. Auto runs like a bus, from stop to stop, the vehicle picks up and delivers product on demand. It fulfills a need that no other material handlers, quite frankly, could. Every single choice a customer makes when designing their product means a change to our manufacturing flow. This must be accounted for in the process layout, which makes it very complex to manage. Sometimes conveyorized flow just doesn't work. We knew this complex logistical challenge could only be solved with autonomous mobile robots. We also placed tremendous value on safety and wanted to find a more optimal solution than adding more tow motors on the floor. We're now at the warehouse and Auto's final destination, where it will drop off the finished doors at the automatic storage system. It's quite amazing how careful and precise Auto maneuvers to complete its mission. After this is done, the material is received in the back of the warehouse, where it's then staged for shipping to the end customer. It's great having Auto in our warehouse, but none of this matters if it doesn't help our bottom line. We're proud to share that after only 16 months, we've achieved a 100% safety rate, which means we've had zero accidents with auto. This is the first material handler that hasn't hit anything. Within the same 16 month time frame, we've also reached our ROI, completing over 7,000 missions and delivering more than 2.5 million pounds of patio doors. Implementing the auto platform has allowed us to standardize our processes and meet our clients' growing demands. Auto has exceeded our expectations and phase two of implementation is already underway to expand our fleet. 